Welcome right side audience and welcome Donald Trump to Kissimmee, Florida. I'm Bill, this is Jesse, we're big fans of Right Side Broadcasting. I've watched every Trump rally on there since the beginning, brother. You guys rock! More than I can say, I haven't watched every rally on there. Sometimes like, we work on them. I want to uh, are you local here in Kissimmee? Claremont, we're from Claremont. From and when did you, right let me ask you a question, when did you discover Right Side Broadcasting? When I went in and Googled uh, Trump rally with the, with, the, with the date, because we wanted to hear it straight from the horse's mouth. This was a year ago we found you guys on there. And uh, every day, the next day when people, when my friends say, did Trump really say that? I can tell them the context because I watched the rally from start to finish. Do you ever watch the pregame show? I'm kind of partial to those. Well, I usually catch it live. So when I when I go in, it's like it starts at 7, and that's when we catch it. But I haven't, I, I have, I'm ashamed to say I haven't seen the pregame show. But now that I've met you, I will watch every okay, You can always go back and look at old ones. I did during the convention. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cool. And the kids love it too. Yeah, great. My kid, when that, that music you guys play. Hey, Jacob my, Seals, that's the CEO's that brother. That is my son's theme song. He's two years old. Can you hum it for us? Da -na -na -na. It's dad rock. Da -na 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 -na. Yeah, it, when, when that's when that's what comes on, it's like. Dun, 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 dun. My kids run out of the bedroom. She's nine years old. My uh -huh. son's two. We're dancing around the house like some maniacs. They love that stuff. Can you get them out here? We'll get them to it. I, 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 I'm give kidding, me an hour. I'm kidding. Give me an hour. I'll give you an hour. Okay, I'll check in with you in an hour. Yeah. I'm serious. You think I'm not? I'm not. I am. All right. I'll meet you back here Tell in an that hour. Guy he's got some, the, 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 what's his name that says this, does the music? Jacob Seals. Tell him he's got some fans. All right. He'll All right. see this. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you. Adam Taxon continuing here in Kissimmee, Florida, outside the Silver Spurs Arena with more fans of Right Side Broadcasting. All right. First of all, i got to get your cats in here. Get the heck, you put in some effort the there. Yeah. You don't want to take off your shirt. That would be more popular oh, at the fine. Democratic Convention. Yeah, <laughs> you got that, right. that voice of yours is awesome. You oh, remind me of the guy you. in Cameo. No, Word up. That. Thank you. Cat for you. Okay. Oh, we got cats everywhere. Well, I like right. this crowd so far. All right. <laughs> all right. So you've heard. Not only have you heard of Right Side Broadcasting, you're fans of it. Apparently. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yep. Yep. When did you discover Right Side Broadcasting? I learned of Right Side Broadcasting on the conservativetreehouse.com right. about a year ago. <laughs> conservativetreehouse.com. I'm familiar forget. with it. They did some so actually groundbreaking. Yeah. The main. Nice. Totally. Uh, have you been following current events lately? Absolutely. Uh, what do you think of these, uh, de the demise of these Democrat interns, etc.? More, three more people connected to the Clintons uh, in the yeah, last few weeks. Yeah, sounds like Arkansas to me. <laughs> Uh, any other thoughts on the? How about the media? The way they're covering things. I want Don, I want Donald Trump to call out the networks by name. I want him to say, "Okay, Fox, you're fair and balanced. Let's see you spin the camera." And that way, every other network should want to show how he's making Fox look bad. I want to see him call each and every network out by name, especially and, ours, by the way, and shame them into doing a 360 camera shot of this venue. Yeah. Every one I've been to has been packed to the rafters, and they're turning two or three thousand people away every every event. Huh? Absolutely. Uh, you notice on RSBN, we've been doing some crowd shots lately. Aye, aye, some comparative photographs. Yes, me personally, indeed. you know. Awesome, dude. Yeah. Right on. That's great. Thank oh, you. You like the do, crowd shots? You do really good work. Anything? Yes, you, any special requests for uh, shots of the crowd? Do you want? The, the handsome man, do you want? All right. Oh, you want to be on there. Well, you have to show me where you're sitting. Hey, you want to be stage left. Okay, cool. All right, how about you want to give us a Make America Great Again? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Two, big time. Three. Yeah, Make America Great Again, dude, absolutely. i got to get my hat. Adam Taxon continuing on at Silver Spurs Arena with three young ladies. Uh, we're in Kissimmee, Florida. Uh, ladies, you're for Trump, but I thought Trump is so anti-women, and aren't you so touched by the fact that Hillary Clinton has made history? Hold on. I'm honored to vote for Trump. Hillary is a loser. Yeah, let's get a little more straight. What do you like best about Donald Trump? I like it because he tells it like it is, and he's going to make America great again. How about you too? Hillary get, gets money from all of these countries that are so anti-women women, that it's a joke that any woman would, would vote for her. I can see men voting for her, but women, no. 
She is anti-woman. She is the devil. And when Trump gets in, he is going to make sure that she is locked up where she de deserves well, to be. Technically, it'll be you know a judge somewhere. Oh no, way, he'll but. make sure. He even said it. He even said it. He's going to reopen the case. We'll change the constitution on that. He's going to get her. Okay. And unfortunately, um, no, I'm not happy that Hillary is the first woman because it's a disgrace because she's so corrupt. Yeah, and also she is on a coat for a first woman to be uh, the top. It was all on Bill's coattails, don't you think? Well, not only that, I mean, she couldn't even pass the bar exam. She did the second time, as did Michelle Obama. She, but the D.C. bar, by the way, is one of the easiest, as is the Illinois bar. I mean, if... JFK Jr. failing the New York bar, I can, and he did it twice, but I can kind of understand that. that one's hard. No, she didn't fail the Arkansas bar, she failed the D.C. bar. Oh, okay, DC's sorry. DC's yeah. the easiest of them all, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. I mean, to be fair, you know, you probably don't put in as much preparation when a bar exam is uh, considered easier. You know, she might have studied harder if it were like California, which is known as the hardest. Well, I don't advocate either any woman that would represent a 44-year-old man that rapes a 12-year-old girl and oh, then yeah. brags about it. Yeah, she laughed about it, too. Yeah, she's a disgrace to all, all of the United States of America. She doesn't belong here. And Donald Trump, the reason why I want him to win is he has no agenda but to make our country great again. He's not part of the establishment. He's America's greatest hero. That's what he is. Greatest hero America's ever seen is Donald Trump. Well, he you know, plus he, he I know what Donald on. Trump would say. No, our military men are yes, police Donald officers. Donald Trump, he's risking everything. He's yes. giving up a life of luxury all for us because he loves America. Yes, he wants to make it great again, and he will. He'll put the best people in the right places, as he does in all of his businesses. You know, you said something uh, I want to just get back to. Uh, do you think a lot of the reason, like, some of these rhinos are so against him is because he really will throw out members yes, of the establishment? Yes, absolutely. And that's they, why they're saying, oh, he's mean, he says terrible things, it's just a cover? Absolutely, 100%, because he's not part of the establishment, right. and it's not going to be politics as usual anymore. And he's not going to change. He's that's hysterical, and he's real, and that's exactly who he is, he's not going to change it because people want him to. He's not going to change that's why all these Republicans, these 50, are going against him because they know that he won't put up with their corrupt ways. Yeah, they may have to work for a living now. Oh, gosh, yeah. If Hillary wins, I'm going on food stamps. Woohoo! <laughs> uh, one final thought. You've heard about these a few more deaths of people related to the Clintons uh, the last few weeks. You haven't heard about that? Yes. Oh, absolutely. Oh, Seth Rich, etc. I call her Killery for a reason. The list just keeps getting longer and longer. It's yeah. deplorable. Watch the debates, people. If you watch the debate, you will vote for Trump. He is going to clean her clock. Hillary should be locked up. Go Trump. Get the whole story, not just the clips of the media. Watch the whole debate. And what, ne what network should you watch that on besides Fox? Right side. Right side. Right side. Absolutely. Uh, you want right to give side. us a Make America Great Again or a Lock Her Up? Take your pick at one, two, three. Here, wait. I got something Make for you. Make America Great I got Again. Something for you. Donald Trump will be our president. January. I made, I made it myself. Nice. There you wait, wait. Go. I'm going to hold it a little wider so we get a better shot. You're holding there it. There we go. Hold it open. Let's open it up all the way. No, hold it wide. There you go. Beautiful. Right. Thanks, ladies. Thank you. Trump. Well, we hope he's watching. Yeah, he's yes. going to be watching, don't worry. And I hope all of my free for friends are watching as well. Oh, freerepublic.com. We have mixed feelings about oh, that. Oh, well, we love them over there. Uh, mixed feelings. Okay, but well, you're free for... Well, they're, they're Trumpers now, please. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> we, we like that. Yeah. Uh, any thoughts on recent events or what you hope Trump says tonight? Uh, I, I, I think he'll be on fire today, but I think he'll probably be just to make sure we just not give them any more ammunition than they really need to have. Gotcha. Yep. Anyone else want to be on with RSBN? Thank you for your time today. You got it. Don't you want to take my picture? Yeah, I, want to I didn't to my even. Sister. Oh, hold on. Someone wants to take my picture. I didn't shower yet today. That's okay. Okay. Thank you. I mean, my side's better. You want to do it this way? It's yours. Okay. This is great TV, let me tell you. Now, what can I tell her? What can I tell her? You uh, the wrote? cameraman for RSBN. All right, thank you. Thank you. You Okay, welcome to Right Side. We're going to the uh, Donald Trump rally today. And Right Side is the station to watch because the fact that it shows everything you need to know on Donald Trump. Thank you.
Another RSBN fan here. That's right. I found it about six months ago. My daughter turned me on to it, and I've been hooked. My name is Bill. I'm a Christian. I'm an American, and I'm proud to support Donald Trump. Donald Trump is going to make this country great again. You may not agree with everything that Don says. You might not agree with everything he does. However, if you can agree with anything Hillary Clinton does, you need to take a reassessment of your values as an American. If the Constitution of the United States means anything to you, especially the Second Amendment, think long and hard before you cash that ballot for Hillary Clinton. Clinton is going to destroy our country. If Clinton is elected, we have two, maybe three generations left in America. Oh, well, that might be generous. Well, yeah, but Donald Trump is going to fix things, and I'm thoroughly convinced on January 20th, at the end of him saying, I do, stuff is going to happen. I know that Don is very smart, and he has a lot of people. There's probably already stuff going on for his cabinet, deals in Congress with Republican Congress to get things written and done. So. He does it that day. There will be no honeymoon when Donald Trump takes no. office. He is going to work right away. And he is going to make America great. That's something. Yeah. Uh, if you look at the history of the world, 1,200 years ago, the radical Islamist extremists tried to take over the world. It took the Crusades to end it. 1,200 years later, we're in the same spot. They want to take over the world. We don't have a crusade, but we've got Donald Trump. He's our King John. Help us defeat these radical Islamic terrorists once and for all. Hey, what's up? It's Todd right here. Uh, I just want to say, go Donald Trump. I'm a huge Donald Trump fan. I'm 17, but I'm just, wow. You came out here early today. Yes, You're not sir. worried about getting too hot? No. You're hydrating? Yes, sir. Okay. I mean, Hillary, she's been lying and lying. The FBI is investigating her. And that's not what we need right now. You know what? I have a question for you as a 17-year-old. You know, you probably still have to deal with a lot of rules. Does it bother you that you have to deal with so many rules and, like, if you break the law, especially as a younger person, you know, the law is going to come on to you. But for her, it doesn't seem to apply whatsoever. Exactly. That's because, you know, she's part of the Senate and something like that. She can make things happen. And I'm pretty sure she has secrets that nobody knows about. Yeah. You think? Yeah. They, they let it pass, let it go. Yep. There's so much stuff we have no idea that she's done wrong, I imagine. I know. I mean, Donald, Donald's just going to stop that. Gonna, we hope. We hope. All right. Thanks for your time today. You too. Mark Byrne. He is outstanding. He is a Trump supporter from day one. That man electrifies the people in in the stadium. You know you can call into the Colors That Unite on Sunday nights on RSBN, right? I did not know that. Oh, yeah, you got to tune in. Okay. <laughs> you can call in, tune in live. Thank you. Sunday nights on Thank RSBN. You. But he's the greatest person. I'm going to tell you something. I mean, he, that person, he knows Trump from here to there. I mean, it's great. He's a good man. He's a great man. When he wants to make sure that the people in the auditorium wants to know, he will start stretching his hand. No, no. <laughs> We at Right Side Broadcasting love our veterans, as Donald Trump says, and uh, you've offered to share some thoughts many hours before the Donald Trump rally coming up. Well, I'm Command Sergeant Major Betancourt, and I'm here to for this rally for Mr. Trump. Uh, I would like to add something that uh, it means a lot to us, the VA. Uh -huh. uh, we heard Hillary stating that the VA corruption was overblown, and she hasn't gone to the VA. We, the veterans, know what's going on. And and the corruption good. is not good. We have to wait for so long. And many veterans have given up. They are in the streets. They they without health care. And the, the American people is in the notion that everything that is coming out of the media is true. Uh -huh. And uh, I even changed CNN's name. It's, I call it Clinton Network. News network, yeah, because or communist or Castro yes. news network. The, the problem is that we have been lied to us, you know. And the only thing you have to look at is that her resume. She has file gate, travel gate. She has more gates than these stadiums. Hey, she has news just from the last week. And three interns dead. So many, something. so many problems that are alien our, our veterans that go and fight for, for our freedoms, the freedoms that she uses to lie to us. Mm -hmm. And for the sake of God, people, make your mind 
on the honesty of a person. Don't make it uh, because Mr. Trump said a little word here and there. Look at 40 years of politics with Hillary and you will find out that nothing has come out good. Thank you and I'm going to enjoy this rally like never. And next president is going to be Donald Trump. And thank you for your service. Thank you. Pulled me aside because he was doing his job and wanted to make sure I had no outstanding warrants. And uh, well, you're not escaping out here, out of here without a little something from the crowd. One, two, three. Blue Lives Matter. Yeah. Trump. Trump. All right. Who wants to talk to Right Side Broadcasting? All right. What's going on, Hillary for president? So president, infowars.com. Okay, but how about rsbn.tv if you're going to put that in there? Also, also that too. No, how about saying the word rsbn.tv? rsbn.tv. Okay, now let's talk. Also. Hillary for prison. What do you think of those three suspicious deaths the last few weeks of people uh, connected to Hillary Clinton, Seth yeah, they, Rich, etc.? Uh, they seem to be the people that were in charge of most of the data. And uh, I did some research and I saw that uh, Wiki, uh, Wiki, WikiLeaks was talking about how he may have been uh, working for them. Yeah, he, Julian he, Assange he said, so. it, Yeah, he wouldn't say it outright. But, so did you, wait, wait, let me ask. Did you hear about this on CNN or MSNBC oh, or CBS? No, not, a, not a shot. Nope. Nope. InfoWars, actually, I heard about it. Yeah. Uh, let me ask a question. My parents were actually having an argument. They said a good criminal, my parents are not criminals that I'm aware of. Yeah. Like my mom and dad were arguing, I forgot who took what position. Said a smart assassin would have taken this guy's wallet, wouldn't he? Have? What's your feeling on that? Well, it sounds, I mean, you can put it how you want, but it sounds like they're kind of sending a message. Yeah. Uh, they're kind of putting it right in your face, and they're saying, um, we're not even going to try to cover it up for all you people who want to, uh, yeah, yeah. I, I, I mean, whatever. Or Arkansas. I thought it was weird how Debbie it's, it's Wasserman. Kind of, it's, kind of like, it's kind of like a scare attack. Yeah, kind of like wasn't it weird how Debbie Wasserman or Debbie Blabbermouth Schultz, as Rush calls her, uh, put such an over the top message uh, out about him uh, the next day when he was on Bernie's side and she clearly didn't like him? It was just a little weird. Yeah, I wasn't too sure about that whole scenario. No, I didn't get into that. All right, you want to say something to Right Side? Uh, no, I'm good, sir, but thank you. Sure. What's Speaking going on? I'm just relating out here. I've been uh, keeping uh, hydrated. I'm Hot trying idea. my best. You know, I live you know, between the Jacksonville and Daytona rallies the other week, and I couldn't make it, so I definitely wanted to. Thanks for making really the trip early. down here. You got the day off work or something? Yeah, pulled some strings, managed to get the day cool. off. Uh, any thoughts on uh, what you hope Trump says today? I'm just hoping to you know hear what he thinks about what's going on everywhere. You know, I've been sort of keeping track with him since. When he came out last year. You like living in a swing state? Yeah, I think it's definitely going to be nice because my vote will count just a little bit more. Thinking about working election day to help prevent the inevitable vote fraud from oh, the yes, Democrats? Oh, yes, definitely. I want to be able to work there in the polls, you know, do my best. To, Are you going to call, you know, contact your local Republican leader? Yeah, definitely. And get on in their case if they act like never Trump? You betcha. All right, you're the man. All right. Thank you. We're fans of Right Side Broadcasting here, uh, you wanted to say something? Right side. Yeah, we love, we, lo we love RSBN. That's my favorite TV. What What do you like best about RSBN? I can go in there to see news, like the news and the Trump rallies. You ever any, watch any Pastor rallies. Mark Burns? Yes, I love that. Nice. He's he a great is speaker. wonderful. He's a great. He's a great speaker. He really is. Very inspirational. Yeah, yeah. Except I'm when like, we're working the camera, we have to turn the volume down yes. on him because and he speaks so loud. Also, Diamond and Silk, right? <laughs> you have Diamond and Silk also? Oh, yeah, Diamond yeah, and Silk. Yeah, that's wait, my wait. favorite. My they always watch this. Do you want to give a special? Do you want to say, hey, y'all, like Diamond and Silk? Hey, y'all, Diamond and Silk. Nice. Come with me. <laughs> now, do you have a connection to Cambodia? Uh, do I? Uh, well, uh, I'm from there. Oh, you're yeah. from Cambodia. Okay. Cool. Any thoughts? Well, Cambodia has been through a lot, and oh, yeah. does that inform why you, you know, the troubles Cambodia has gone through? Is that part of why you like Donald Trump? Well, uh, I kind of admired Donald Trump for a while now, ever uh -huh. since I knew him. So. But you guys know about, or you're a little young for it, but Cambodia certainly knows about communism and tyranny. Uh, yeah. Are you of Cambodian background? Oh, okay. Sorry. All right. Can you give us a... You're from Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Yeah. Never been to Puerto Rico, but I've been to Thailand. It's a beautiful country. Yeah. It's wonderful. Uh, do you all want to get together and do a, say, one, two, three, make America great again? Yes, yes. I want to 
Okay. Okay, one, two, three. Make America great. <laughs> two brothers from ZBT, one of the most prestigious Jewish frats uh, in the country, though you say you're not Jewish. You could pass, by the way. You could probably pass more easily than I can. Uh, the tall guy. You're really tall for a Jewish or any guy, except for maybe Dutch. How tall are you? Six foot nine. Wow. Um, let me just adjust the camera up. This doesn't have to happen much. Yeah. Some thoughts on why Jews, and they're very important here in Florida, uh, need to get behind Trump. Well, he's going to do a lot better for Israel than Hillary will. So I definitely feel like he's going to bring, he's going to uh, keep his relations strong <laughs> and make sure that we don't lose relations with them. That's why I support Trump. That's why Jews should also support Trump. Do you think, uh, I just got the feeling Trump and Netanyahu are going to see eye to eye. They'll be able to get along in a way that, let's face it, Obama's kind of a girly man. Netanyahu's not going to feel comfortable with that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I definitely agree with you there. Yeah, those two and Putin can get together for vodka. He's not, enough, he's not a strong enough player on the world stage. Like, you see, when he gets off of planes in the Middle East or anywhere that's not a Western country, when yeah. he gets off the planes, there's no greeting parties, there's nothing really there for him. It's like, all right, send him to the place he needs to go. But if when Trump gets off a plane, I imagine yeah. they're going to have greeting parties. It's funny, because, like, you guys are ZBT, so you're not beta males. Uh, but Obama's so beta, you know? It's just like, look at the way he's mocked in Egypt and, like, those countries that take our money. And he wants America to be like that. Yeah. yeah. That's how he wants to model and frame America. It's kind of good for you guys being college guys. You probably get more girls because so many guys act like panty waist. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely being a fraternity helps with that. Yeah. <laughs> um, just... I'm, I don't no reason to bring this up to you rather than anyone else. Have you heard the stories? Uh, this is just the current issue about Hillary's health. By the way, good idea with the bottle of water. I see Thank too you. few of them today, and it's hot here. I've seen a lot about Hillary's health. I was watching a video uh, from Infowars, the Paul Joseph Watts, and he was talking about uh, you know like whenever multiple people talk at the same time, she uh, has something indicative. Like it's a it's a common trigger for seizures. Yeah. And you see her head move wildly, her mouth opens up, and like her eyes go all over the place. It's really bizarre. Yeah, happens, I don't remember like, those mannerisms when she was first. Lady, either. No, and like, you know, like when she fainted back in 2012, I believe it was, uh, like a good portion of people that faint and get uh, the blood caught in the blood, it, it causes uh, long term brain damage. Uh -huh. yeah. And then someone uh, pointed out a picture of me where she had a small lesion on her tongue. Yeah. That's a very, a very uh, common sign of syphilis, which obviously, as everyone knows, goes straight to the brain. She yeah. could have gotten it from uh, Slick Willie. How? Got her oh, so well, obviously. How would she have gotten it from Slick Willie? Sexually transmitted. Why would that have occurred between them? I don't know. See, I think maybe I just like, can't imagine it's that. probably a once a month written agreement. I can't imagine. <laughs> I just can't imagine that has happened any time in recent years. But okay, maybe it's been there for a while and the stuff just came out. Maybe what college are you guys at, by the way? Uh, UCF. It's right over, in, right like 40 minutes away. I don't know where that is. Okay. Cool. I hear they have a strong Chabad over there. Sorry? They have a strong Chabad over there, from what yeah, I hear. I actually go to the good amount. What's the rabbi's name again? Uh, rabbi Chaim Lipsky. That's right. That's, there's so yeah, many. Great guy. All right, now we're getting off track for our audience, but uh, nice uh, talking to you guys. All right, you too. Thank you. People apparently like right side broadcasting. Well, yeah, I just saw your T-shirt, and we watch all the rallies and the townhouses, and I always see right side come up, and I'm so thankful to you. Because I've been able to follow the whole campaign, all the cool. rallies. Have you this been, is my first rally. This is your first rally. Yes. Are you guys local? Uh, well, yeah, about an hour away. I wouldn't have to. What, what area are you? We're near Inverness, Florida. Inverness is where? Inverness. Inverness. Citrus County. Citrus, Citrus County. County. Oh, that's by Tampa, right? Yeah. It's What's up, John? It's 60 miles north no of Tampa. Trump. Um, well, I have a feeling Trump's going to be spending quite a lot of time in this area. I'm going to be getting to know Florida, which I already know well, and Ohio very well the next few months. Uh, any thoughts about women? Like, my women here, sorry to exclude you there, um, about why you're not supporting such a historic person as Hillary Clinton, as CNN, MSNBC, etc. want you to believe. She's not the right woman. Not the right woman. That's almost generous. That's almost too charitable. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm <laughs> she, I, look, she should be in prison. Sorry. I'm sorry, could you come closer? I've always felt like women can do anything they wanted to do. We didn't need Hillary. Right. There She's we go. the wrong right. But they'll be the right one, but not yet. It's not, it's okay. not about your sex or your gender anyway. It's who's got the right ideas, who's going to stand for what's right yeah. on the right side. That's right. Sounds good to us. This is my fourth 
Trump rally. I live about a mile and a half from here, so I'm really glad this one's close. Uh -huh. And I've been on the Trump train since day one, and Trump I love him. Yeah. And Right Side, I subscribe to Right Side. It comes on to my phone. As soon as it comes on, bam, I'm sharing to all the Trump sites. Now, have you been watching the pregame shows uh, the last week or two? I saw one of them okay. this Okay, do I look familiar yet? Oh, um, yeah. All right, all right, I got to promote myself. People know Pastor <laughs> Burns a little bit better, and oh, they know yeah, uh, Wayne Dupree. No, so. I absolutely love Right Side. Trump hat. Yeah. Yeah. Trump hat. Here, we'll, Trump give, hat. we'll give you some publicity. Thank you all. Oh, do you want to add anything? No, I just said Trump's got to win because Hillary can't do it. There's no way. All we do is sit on the watch no right way. side. It's impossible. We watch every, everything. It's impossible. Well, wait, I don't want you He's just... He's got the connections. I don't want you just saying that. Trump's got the positive connections. He's got everything that he needs to make this country a lot better than what it is and what it has been. Let me, ask, let me ask you a question. You said you're going to just stay home and watch Right Side. We encourage that, but what are you going to do on Election Day? Because vote fraud is a problem. Are you on the case of your local Republican leaders how to volunteer on Election Day? Absolutely. Oh, you know it. What are you guys doing on Election Day? We're going to be voting for Trump. No, but what else are you going to be doing? Are you going to help monitor the elections in places where they stuff the ballot box? Absolutely. Oh, definitely. We're going to be there. I didn't even thought that far ahead. Oh, I'm thinking that far ahead. We need people to do that. Prepared. You have to be prepared on we're, all We're connected all, with the Republican steps. Party office. We're going okay. to get more involved with Get on their case starting early. Say, if they don't do everything they can Trump's to... Trump's going to win. Trump's going to win. Yeah, well, with the help, but you guys got to work on Election Day. You ain't going to get beat by no girl. Come on. No, okay, but they, you know where they do it. They have the vote. They stuff the votes in places like inner city Tampa, inner city Philadelphia. Well, did with the last election. Yeah, get out and volunteer. I'm That's glad you sure run that this out. country down. Yeah. All right, Great thank day. you. Thank you. More people who two Woo! two more ladies who apparently know right side broadcasting. Yes, sir. So you watch our network. Yes, sir. Uh, good. <laughs> yes, sir. So I imagine you do not have such strong positive feelings about the former first lady. No. That's common here, but what bothers you the most about her? Is it the voice? Is it the cackle? Is it the substantive evil things she's done? Uh, actually, it's the evil stuff she's done. I, I don't care about people's voices. I don't, I don't care about things like that. Her looks, nothing. It's the evil that she's done to our country and continues to do, and the government refuses to acknowledge everything she's done, ABC News cast overdone one of Trump's things about the Second Amendment. Yeah, right. And I went on their news feed and said, hey guys, you know, uh, Newsmax, okay, the one guy David left, he's no longer there, and he quit because they're, they're cens censoring all the news. Yeah. And ABC Someone on their news feed tried to hack into my Facebook. Oh, wow. Yeah, so... And we're so close ABC, to their parent company's Disney yes, World right here. Yes, sir. And ABC News, they're corrupt. They're all corrupt. Media, can, ooh, I have a media. request. Yes, sir. Instead of saying ABC, can you say Disney? Because Disney has this positive image, yet they're the people behind all this crap, and we're right by Disney World. You got some strong feelings there. You want to tell uh, us about that? Come on over. Don't say ABC. Say Disney. Disney. Because Disney. Disney. Yeah. Disney's corrupt. Yes. yes. Disney's corrupt. How is Disney, not ABC, affecting this election? Um, well, they're first of all, they're hiring illegals yeah. to take the place of American jobs. Mm -hmm. And that's disgraceful. And they also, even their ships, they register them out of the country. Mm -hmm. They're Disney cruise ships, which is wrong because we don't get the tax money. Yeah, I that's guess right. everyone does that, not just Disney. Yeah, I know. That's true. Um, Walt would be disgusted. Yeah. Walt yeah. was a conservative. Exactly. Continuing on here. <laughs> okay, uh, ABC News. What? Who? Disney. Okay, that's okay. better. <laughs> Disney, the very next day after Hillary had the terrorist dad at her rally, that ABC. Not only be at her rally, her. sitting right yes, behind right her. Right behind her. Well, then Disney wants to show. Mark Foley sitting around by, right behind Trump. And he killed a 50 fewer people, few, well, 50 fewer people that, than uh, yes. Mateen's son, right? Well, they said that he had been arrested for uh, little boys. Yeah. Mark Foley. Yeah. Now, they want to throw a little piece, and you can see it on their website, right. where it shows a small piece of, oh, 
little, here's a little picture of Mark Foley. Sitting right behind Trump, right? Right behind Trump. Oh, he was. And that was. Oh, he was right behind Trump. But it's not the same. No. No, it wasn't. Oh, no. No. kidding. No. No. I think it's because, yes, because it was such a little short thing like that. Uh Uh-huh. I think it was a setup. Because of what happened. Why Mark Foley? I mean, why not go with, like, OJ or something? I know, right? (laughs) But, no, that's what they did. That's what I think That's disgusting. Yeah. All right, yep. you you all wanted to say something here? Uh, I just, uh, I saw her, but I'm I just concerned about uh, Hillary and all of uh, her arrogance that she doesn't. Uh, Great choice of words. Yeah, arrogance because she thinks she's above the law. She doesn't uh, think that any of our laws uh, pertain to her. For the little people. Yeah. The serfs. Uh, I'm here to support Trump. Great. <laughs> I got to get this. Show us that button you're proud of. I imagine it's a hot seller. This is a very hot song. Oh, wait. I have to do it this way. Hold on. Sorry. Let me start again. One of the vendors here. Uh, I like the shirt. And the button. Come closer so I can get this on. Very hot seller, apparently. Very hot. Make America great again.